Today, 150,000 farmers in India have committed suicide in areas where seed has been destroyed, where they have to buy the seed from Monsanto and buy it every year at very, very high cost. And that high cost seed is getting them into debt, and that debt is pushing them to suicide. What we've done is create community seed banks, places where we collect and save seeds, rescue them from disappearance, multiply them, and then distribute them according to farmers' needs. And about 40 community seed banks have been created across the length and breadth of India, places where these have been created. Farmers are not in distress because the biggest cost today is seeds and chemicals. These seed banks have now been a new place where we can respond to the new crisis of globalization on the one hand and climate change on the other. Globalization has led to farmer suicides. We are able to take seeds to these suicide zones and distribute the seeds so that farmers can break out of that dependency, grow food crops, get out of debt. We've been able to create community seed banks to deal with climate change, with the extreme flooding, the new droughts, the cyclones, the hurricanes that lead to salinization. And today for us, the work on seed has become the place from where we are responding to the worst tragedies and the worst crises of our times.